Um, so, uh, of course, coming from the position of a former diplomat, my strong core belief is that um, diplomats only do what their government asks them to do. And so my questioning is really always to see um, where you receive the, your direction from working for the government and working for your political masters. Um, so with that, I'll start with um, where are Corvik and Spavor currently detained in China? I'm sorry, uh, but uh, as I explained earlier, due to the Privacy Act, I'm not going to comment on the particular circumstances of the cases. Okay. So then we'll assume that they are um, detained in uh, Beijing for the sake of this. Um, so you mentioned that there is the consular agreement between Canada and China, China Excuse me, beyond the provisions outlined in the Vienna Convention. Um, would we be able to table that document here within the committee? So the consular agreement? Yes. It's available publicly. It's okay. on our website. Super. Um, has there been a contiguous consul um, in Beijing since the time of their detention? Uh, we have always had a mission in Beijing. We have had uh, a, a charge d'affaires, an ambassador, uh, a head of consular section. Okay, but can we? What, has there been one consul since their detention? In terms of the consular officer Correct. in particular? Correct, like one consul. Uh, we have a consular team. Um, if we could get the name of the consul um, since their detention, or if there's been more than one, the names of those and have those brought to the committee, that would very much be appreciated. 